be here today? Well, you know, we're celebrating Art and Neville's life in the Tremay neighborhood where I grew up. The only way we know how to do in New Orleans with a big celebration of his life and music, and he's just so important to our culture. Uh, without him and his family and a few other foot soldiers that created New Orleans funk music, I wouldn't know what New Orleans would sound like today without those guys. Why is it so important to keep passing the music forward to the youngsters? Well, in this very neighborhood, my cousin Glenn Andrews from Reaper Brass Band, a trumpeter, and uh, all of my family members did the same thing for me. Also, the late, great Tuba Fats and all those guys grew up in this neighborhood, and that's what they did to me, so it's, it's second nature to me. And uh, plus the kids, they come up to me, I just get so excited that they even know who I am, so whatever I can help um, teach them, that's what I'll do, you know. For, for Until I die, I'll always give back to the city. And last question, what are some of your lasting memories of Mr. Neville? Uh, you know, I, when I was 13, I went on tour with the Neville Brothers uh, for the entire summer, and just being able to pick his brain and play on stage with him night after night in different cities and learn some of the music firsthand from him, it was incredible. And, and I remember the first time I took over the Jazz Fest slot from the Neville Brothers, he was there to cheer me on and shake my hand and give me a hug and tell me good luck, so I'll never forget that. Thank you, I appreciate your time. I Anytime, thank you.